Hello dear friends. Here is Pavel Smutny from Banska Šťavnica and this is my second part of uh, video where first part was about uh, observations of the most advanced uh, civilizations uh, during our ancient past about observations of uh, the most distant objects in our solar system Nibiru and Nemesis Nibiru very often called also Planet X that Planet X is responsible for uh, regular global catastrophes on Earth global floods when Earth is over flooded when those tidal forces are uh, many times bigger than for example tidal forces of uh, moon and also there are so-called solar events when solar plasma is by gravity of that uh, planet Nibiru when it's in area is ejected from the sun and earth is overheated by phantom objects from that plasma by those uh, phantom suns like it was mentioned also in Chinese legend about Archer, I who had to shot nine from ten sun, uh, suns which were on the sky. So, on the beginning, I show you those uh, last things uh, because uh, it was about uh, about observations of Nibiru. And now I devote I would devote time mainly to devices, to uh, buildings, constructions which were used uh, for observing of Nibiru. Because those uh, huge devices, pyramidal system, were actually or was actually active telescope with oven power plant. So, uh, what should I say? What should I say again? Okay, so here were those observations from uh, some place on Earth. We see here three windows, three portals. Okay, and from these uh, portals, Earth was uh, on Earth was observed constellation Orion and arrival of Nibiru from its Aphelia somewhere far over there to Perihelia okay close to Earth. On the sky was such path. Measurements were done twice a year. Here we have measurements during equinoxes very probably spring autumn no spring autumn so this looks like orbit of earth yes here 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 or we see it here 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 and we see spring autumn spring autumn positions of earth on orbit around sun okay so if this is spring autumn spring autumn so half years but Relatively, it moved on sky such way toward constellation Orion. Okay, here is ecliptic plane. Three portals, like three windows. When we look, for example, here we have three windows. Okay, so we can observe also from room such way sky. Yes. A similar way it was done. So that first window here is orbit of Nibiru. It was observed from Aphelia of Nibiru, circa 45 billion kilometers. Here is that M42 Nebula in Orion constellation. Okay, do you see it? Orion Nebula, and this is solar system. This is orbit till Mars, band of asteroids, this is Apollo, Athena orbits, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, Neptune, yes, side view. 
So this observation was from that distance 45 billion kilometers. And this was observation from Earth. But we see windows like when we observe and here is ecliptic plane. And here is Orion, but about ecliptic like when we look on a sky somewhere from southern hemisphere. South Africa, Australia or South America, yes. Because Egyptian, those uh, scientists, those uh, priests mentioned that Earth was overturned, that where was four times it happened in Egyptian in Kemet history. Where was east, was south, where was north, where was north is, is east and where was south is west. Here. But this is ecliptic plane. And we see here Regal Sype, Betelgeuse, Bellatrix, Orion, uh, Nebula, somewhere here. Yes. What was the result of those observations? This curve, okay? Last year's of, of, of observations. You see it here. Let me look here. What do you see? This is that window, okay? That Orion. And this is the last, or not absolutely, but last years before perihelia, Orion. And what we hear, what we see here is what was measured by a Milagro cosmic particle a pool detector Los Alamos okay. in years 2000 to till 2009. This telescope, this uh, pool detector, very big, like a football stadium, uh, was measuring uh, cosmic particles, because also here were used cosmic particles, okay, for measurement. So, do you see? Those occur Orion. When we look here and here, it is very similar. Okay. So, probably <laughs> that Nibiru um, uh, arrived to perihelia, but uh, present perihelia is somewhere behind planet uh, Neptune. Because Nibiru is very uh, heavy object, but very dark, small, with big density. Okay? So, very similar results. When they published those results, that the research, the telescope was closed, project was cancelled, okay? What is next? Uh, next I show you technologies, what were used for observations of Nibiru. That whole Giza complex was active telescope with oven power plant. How it was working? I show you firstly the depiction of that uh, complex. Probably Giza Plateau with those uh, three pyramids. Hufu, Hafre, Menkavre. Okay. When we look here on this window, on carpet, you see top view. Hufu, Hafre, Menkavre, three pyramids on Giza Plateau. This is top view, one, two, three, and this is side view. Here is side view. Here are pyramids, 100 still, 150 meters till, such way. And here is something like parabolic, big parabolic antennas. Here are su such signs like, like plus. Plus mean protons, plus charge, okay? Because 
cosmic particles were used. That complex uh, accelerated uh, protons after hydrolysis of water, because protons are actually cores of hydrogen, and those uh, hydrogen uh, cores, those uh, protons were beamed uh, like from laser laser to direction where Nibiru nemesis are and after reflection where those uh, particles detected protons plus okay here were very big constructions like parabolic antennas here is this parabolic antenna open okay and here were cons constructions because they need electricity uh, and uh, complex was used probably for another purposes too uh, so electricity was produced also such way that here were uh, big towers like uh, turbines like uh, wind uh, wind power stations power plants here were those uh, turbines and here were towers here it looks like uh, charges when here are electric charges and lightnings from those uh, charges and here it is separated okay so here is something like isolator so uh, very very big one kilometer high or so those uh, towers wind towers and those uh, static electric towers here are clouds do you see clouds are usually one two kilometers about about the uh, surface of earth okay and here is dark blue sky and something like satellite or some devices maybe 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 those okay those which were shown those geostationary satellites body parabolic antennas photovoltaic panels here here earth okay so such way it was we have here parabolic antennas when this is probably receiving plus charges and here we have another depiction when this is parabolic antennas are in other position here is not here are those plus and here is minus okay also top view on pyramids side view these two are here 30 somewhere behind this construction when i look here okay here is computer uh, next window what we have here do you see here's Things, Hufu, Hafre, Menkavre, and here is Sphinx Temple, and here is also that very temple, and over there Mortuary Temple. So one, two, three pyramids, like it is on that carpet. So this is side view, okay. And here is top view, okay. One, two, three, top view. Uh, these pyramids looks also like bent or are built also like bent of Orion constellation okay let's think what is here and I'll speak more about uh, about temples which are close what are very close uh, to pyramids those temples are not actually temples 
but technological buildings were used for uh, water mixing and that water was hydrolyzed but by, not by electricity absolutely only not by this but also by light light was focused to temples those are rooms uh, here is a microwave uh, coupler triplate six port coupler so such things are used in electronics for example on high frequencies 2 10 60 and more gigahertz okay here okay do you see these uh, like rooms like chambers like uh, corridors okay here are inputs outputs and here are those rooms chambers corridors okay such way it looks in those uh, uh, temples in those uh, temples next to Giza and we see that those uh, uh, like tunnels or like chambers or like corridors are surrounded by massive material massive such way it is also with pyramids when we look for example on a valley or on mortuary temple we can see such windows because valley mortuary temples were done from big very heavy very hard stone inside 20 60 tons blocks uh, from diorite or so and around those uh, blocks are blocks from from limestone again very heavy 20 60 80 ton 20 ton heavy blocks and from outside was uh, was covering where big tiles <laughs> again 20 <laughs> or so maybe less uh, tons from very hard material like diorite granite and so we see that here were also some such strange windows like funnel okay why and this was from hard material because that covering is not here here are only these uh, outside limestone blocks but when here was inside big pressure that uh, water or those uh, uh, fumes of hydrogen of oxygen were going out okay with big pressure so it had to be from hard material if not so stone that uh, middle those are middle stones from limestone could be destroyed yes so such way okay last uh, researches last measurements close or on these are pyramids on those the complexes with so-called uh, seismic devices showed that there are many extra rooms in pyramid in pyramids yes which are still not till now not discovered but measurements showed that there are many spaces under pyramid some such way and also inside also inside of the pyramid okay do you see it here narrow tunnels big spaces underground tunnels and underground underground corridors okay this is this is mortuary temple this pyramid okay when we look on bigger window here 
on carpet. We see that here is pyramid. Okay, here are those uh, special, very narrow but long, not corridors but shafts. Okay, pointing on sky. Here are those uh, plus signs for protons for hydrogen. Okay. Here we see those uh, wind. Those are wind power plants. Okay, you see. One, two, three, four. And here are those uh, temples or an underground places, which have also very complicated construction. And these are those uh, static electric towers. Do you see? I saw, here is basement, okay, pyramid, and here is something like isolator. Okay, it looks like depiction from modern times. Okay, isolator, and this is what is underground. There are many shafts, very deep shafts, uh, next to uh, pyramids. Okay, on that plateau, Giza plateau, sixty and more meters uh, deep, quite big, very precisely made. So we see that if this is ground, ground level, those are underground, those are parts, 100 meters maybe or so, okay? So such way. And here is sign for, probably it looks like, water droplets drops here is probably water underground water lake which maybe forms something like a mirror or a lens for amplification for to amplify for arriving cosmic particles okay So what I say next to those uh, uh, depictions, to those uh, technologies, uh, <laughs> maybe partly uh, the technology was reproduced because uh, light was used for hydrolysis. It's possible to do it also in present times, and they are doing it. Okay, overheated wood, water, maybe bit uh, reflected uh, amplified uh, sunlight is uh, after overheating uh, beamed by light such way that there are resonance circles uh, made uh, such way like in uh, so-called urban dotted uh, optic amplifier so, effect is such that after enlightenment, enlightenment of normal light from sun, only one wavelength is amplified, and that wavelength of light is, uh, like in laser systems or masses, is used for hydrolysis of water. When we look on another depictions of those uh, temples, for example, what are over there, We can see structures of temples. Here is the window, but there are also other outlets. Okay, not only 
this, this. This one. You see? Do you see? So here are various devices on waveguides. Okay. This. Here are direction, direction couplets, and here are so-called horn antennas. Shape like pyramid. Okay. These are used for various uh, microwave devices, uh, uh, antennas, uh, for example, at uh, various radars or uh, at uh, various uh, microwave transmitters, transceivers, receivers, what, which are used, uh, for example, at 5G technology. And here is that construction again. Here is that mortuary temple reconstruction light was beamed to this place okay it's tied to site of pyramid okay could i tell more now we are in time when that <laughs> global cheating of monkey is on the top especially west countries especially countries which are very influenced uh, by those uh, billionaires like that's uh, BlackRock, Vanguard and such those uh, uh, not companies but conglomerates, those uh, cartels and we can say various way what are these uh, uh, have profit from uh, such thing that we don't know who we are, where are we from, where we can go, like mankids, like per, uh, individual personalities, and that cheating about uh, spiritual life, about life after death, about uh, life on another uh, spiritual levels, not in this. Uh, uh, hard uh, material state but on another levels on another dimensions so there is that big cheating about this okay though we know that people can astral travel can be outside of their bodies and we know from persons uh, near that who were uh, what is behind about the tunnel, about the relatives, about what happened. Such way it is also with extraterrestrials, with their technologies, maybe part of uh, this technology was uh, used also in those ancient times. And such way it is about extraterrestrials. Okay? Though there are many mentions from Roman times, uh, Plutarchos, Julius of Sequinus, uh, Liber Prodigorum, Titus Livius, uh, Joseph Flavius. Uh, so there are even books about extraterrestrials, about contacts with those uh, entities, about UFOs in various shapes, like we can observe in shape of uh, plates, or they called it uh, the other way. But the same depictions, the same shape. Hmm. What to say next? Mm -hmm. 
if we don't uh, speak, if we don't search about our past, it's possible that we repeat it again. Because those technologies which were used uh, in those ancient times are also reviving now. If we don't use them properly or we don't use them uh, for such way which are useful for, for monkeying, so there could be destruction, uh, that global flood could be again. Because in those ancient times uh, there were so-called gods, half gods, there was that half god El, there, there was Enlil, Enki, it's very similar with uh, this situation. Uh, now we have those uh, billionaires which want to govern us, especially our West, <laughs> so-called West countries, and they want that we obey them. They are not satisfied uh, with number of people on earth because they proclaim openly that they wanted to do such things that uh, we are not 8 billions of people on earth, but they wanted to eliminate minimum 1 billion people and after a longer time they want to eliminate us on 1 billion or less. What technology they use? Such technology probably was used also during previous civilizations because they so-called gods or half gods from previous times, they were not satisfied that there are, there were also many people, so they wanted to reduce. Firstly, they used uh, <laughs> vaccination, that technology with uh, various diseases, with viruses, bacteria, uh, but it wasn't to them very successful. They didn't eliminate it enough. Also in the Maya legends, there was half god El, who uh, caused such way that uh, those uh, people, there are two brothers mentioned, were infected, but uh, Boxes, they had those points, but they didn't know that he was who caused it, and he asked them to help him, and when they help him, he would help him. It's a similar case, like it is now with that Kill Bill, who tried to do with his. Uh, friends, the same things, okay? And what was next? When that uh, process wasn't successful with uh, diseases, with viruses, bacteria, so they tried to use uh, Nibiru. Nibiru is on its orbit which depends on orbit, on motions of that more distant planet, Nemesis. We mentioned it in that previous video. And some arrivals go closer, some arrivals go farther from uh, indoor planets. But high civilization, technologically developed, are able, with motions of smaller asteroid, move with heavier asteroids or small planets, and with small planets they can move with uh, heavier planets, and also with that Nemesis Nibiru. Hmm. And they used those, those knowledge for such things. So we must prevent some such situation. They also tried to change uh, genetics of people. We are now in similar situation 
when with that uh, <laughs> vaccination they tried to change our DNA and those zombies they want to uh, navigate or control by various uh, chips and they want to use that 5G technology because uh, there are not 4000 connections per point but 1, bil 1 million connections per point so one point is for some hundred people so why so many connections okay it's not internet of things of those the common things like your uh, wireless radio or mobile phone or uh, your uh, uh, audio devices or various sensors for uh, ra radiators or <laughs> something other but try to think why are there such many connections and next thing is also connected with power and frequencies also in those times were used uh, uh, various frequencies they called it crystal devices also in your mobile phones in your electronic devices are crystals because silicon is crystal too and those uh, resonators and, uh, and other circuits are also uh, from silicon crystal okay and for example some such people like edgar casey or those who are able to go to past to, to previous lives mentioned that uh, those crystals for example from beginning or especially from beginning were used for healing probably for communication or for production of energy but after particular time they were misused by those technicians maybe by extraterrestrials is mentioned also because there was cooperation like in present time with extraterrestrials and when it was tuned on high frequencies on high power uh, people were tortured by those uh, signals killed and it was also one sort of destruction and also uh, there were such things that when the complex was tuned on higher energy uh, high power was used uh, there were done some experiments so it caused uh, even motion of the earth those uh, plates some tectonic changes mm -hmm. so time is very similar to that one maybe they were even advanced little maybe 50, 100, maybe 100, maybe 500 years, okay, technologically, maybe also spiritually, but also that spirituality, the technology was misused or used on bad purposes. So we must prevent to repeat some such situation. Okay, so thank you very much. It was Pavel Smutny from Banska Stiavnica.